Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to help the channel grow. Thank you. Welcome back to Triple R. Today we have some Dollar Tree soldiers with vehicles. So I got a boat and a motorcycle here. Usually these soldiers just come by themselves, maybe with accessories like a backpack and their weapon. That's about it. So when I saw these ones had the vehicles, I figured I'd pick them up. And I think this was still Dollar Tree Dollar, not Dollar Twenty Five. So for a dollar, not a bad pickup. If you like these soldiers and stuff like that, you can maybe some folks say army build with these soldiers. So very cheap packaging. Just says military. Doesn't give them a name or anything. So like usual, and then they have these weird non-articulation joints. So no, no joints really. Just the elbows are bent. Uh, the legs don't bend. And they move at the shoulders and kind of at the hips. But they don't look bad. The faces on them are usually kind of rough. This guy has a lot of, of the, <laughs> the pouches on his vest. So it kind of cracks me up. So some of those have a lot of pouches. I think it's like 18 I counted or something. So it looks like it's like a big shotgun. Something like a Spa 12 maybe. Can't really tell. And it's iffy if the gun's going to fit in the hand or not. So if you put them so it's going to hold it like sideways if you can't get the shotgun in there. So if you stand good. The boat is okay. It's a little small. But for a dollar it's fine. And then you can try to get this in here see if it's going to work. And sometimes it's in there and when it does go in there it's usually pretty snug. Head moves a little bit. Here's the boat. You got your oars here. They actually move, which is kind of cool. I thought they kind of just be one piece kind of stuck onto the boat, but they do swing side to side. So I don't really help you in the water at all, but it's cool that they move. Uh, it's all kind of this olive drab green. Not too much detail. Has a seat. Kind of has like a steering thing up front there, maybe. But. It's a raft, looks like a raft. <clears throat> so not bad. Now, can he sit in it? That's another story. He can stand in it. But uh, this action figure doesn't bend very well at the hips. That's about all he'll go. So like, it's kind of an issue. So he can stand in the raft, but he can't sit down in the raft. And the raft is a little small as is, as you can see. So, not bad, not great, but for a dollar, for a somewhat usable vehicle accessory, that's cool, I guess. All right, here we have the guy that came with the motorcycle. Same color as the raft, just that dark uh, olive drab green kind of thing. So, I'm sure it came out of the same plastic black mold. As a soldier comes with a rifle with a rather large scope and an extended stock. So this guy's your standard military looking guy you find at Dollar Tree. Got a bandolier, flat top. His arms are in a little different uh, position than the other guy. So his hips let his legs move so he can actually sit down. So he can actually sit him in the raft that comes with the other guy. So maybe that was their their trick to get you to buy all these guys. But he sits in the raft. The guy who comes with the raft does not. That's kind of funny. So there's the rifle. The <laughs> really ridiculous scope. Uh, looks okay though. I mean it's cool it comes with one. There's the motorcycle. The wheels move. Which is nice. This thing's very cheap as you can probably tell just by looking at it. Pretty flimsy uh, handlebars and a flat color. So it does roll. Let's see if you can sit on it here. Probably not going to look very good, but there he goes. Kind of. He's on there. No hands. Oh, 
but it serves its purpose as being a motorcycle vehicle and for a dollar like I said I think that's a good deal rifle fitness hand it's always a question <clears throat> You hear that snap? I think it's pretty snug when it snaps like that. And a lot of times they're always kind of just horizontal, so not like pointed towards the enemy. So maybe shoot sideways. Yeah, because you know, you're driving a motorcycle, you gotta shoot sideways, right? I guess. I don't know. There he goes. So it's almost surprising this thing didn't fall apart. But it didn't. A couple crashes. So it's been crash tested. So here we have the guy with the motorcycle. And rifle with ridiculous scope. Guy with a shotgun and his raft. Who can't fit in his raft or can't sit down in his raft. So you put him on the motorcycle. And you put this guy in the raft. And then you're set. <laughs> Thanks for watching Triple R. Have a good day or night. Wherever you are.